because I really wanted to ask him if he had anything to do, friend, do not dilly dally. It is with the giant ball we found in Sarthal. Although I'm beginning to suspect if I had have spoken to him and asked him that, he probably would have said something along the lines of, What? What are you talking about, you silly person? It definitely looks like a secret treasure room. But it was closed when we went past last time. So this, of course, begs the question. Did it open due to some explosion or one of them, one of those guys screaming and shouting? Did it trigger a mechanism? Or is it some sort of reward from Galdur? Or is it a trap? I mean, it's definitely got the hallmarks of a trap. However... It also has the hallmarks of treasure. I... I am going... to, uh... War Chief Heavy Head... Dre okay, well... Daedric Battle Axe. That... That is definitely something we need. Uh, no, there's no trap there. And... Ooh, Scroll of Abjuration. I am finding rather a lot of... Th I don't need those. Do we need this? Probably. I keep finding those scrolls, which, I don't know, it feels like the universe is trying to tell me something. Okay, we have got what we came for. No, we haven't. We've got the amulet, which is sort of what we came for. But we got absolutely no information that would give us a clue as to why on earth one of the Galder sons was guarding the Eye of Magnus. Which really is making me think it was just a pure coincidence. And that I should file it away as one of those little annoyances that I cannot do anything about. Oh no, we definitely want to keep that. Um, I actually meant to chat with you about that. I noticed it in my pocket, the talk of Labyrinthian. I noticed it when we were at the museum. And I think it's something that Mirabel slipped me. I, I wasn't really paying too much attention at the time, seeing as all hell was breaking loose. She gave me a circlet, and I paid some attention to that because it's shiny. But I also think she gave me that because I can't think of any other time I picked up a talk of Labyrinthian. So I think I should keep hold of that. This is going to be like one of the claws. I have a feeling it's going to be a key for something. So, should we head off? No, it's late. Let's get back to Markarth, have a few hours sleep, and then take the coach to Morthal in the morning. Do you have any thoughts about our current situation? It looks like a machine made this house, and it smells a little oily. Okay, that was not exactly what I meant, but, uh, good to know. I, I suppose it does look a little like a machine made it. It's, it's very precise, really. But I actually think the Dwemer craftsmen were sort of, uh... Well, 
machine-like in their precision. They did like large, grandiose, but very sort of precise. They this home is a bit sterile for my tastes. Nice stonework, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I'm not. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. I, 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 I prefer something like Riften. I, I like solitude, but th there's something about Riften that's kind of cozy. So yeah, no, I'm with you. I'm with you. On my way. Is it just me, or does it feel like a place that bears the name Labyrinthian should be far away from civilization? It should be deep in a mountain somewhere, weeks of struggle away from any creature comforts. It should not be just head out of Morthal, take a left, and you'll see it on your right almost immediately. What do you mean, no? I mean, Labyrinthian, it sounds... Well, it sounds menacing. It sounds mysterious. It does not sound like the local playground or something. I mean, according to the map, we pretty much should be able to see it from... I think that's it. That is it! Oh, God, a bloody saber cap. Just run past it. It's, um, I don't know, disappointing. We're heading off to Labyrinthian. It's the Thalmor. It should sound like an epic journey. It should not sound like we're heading off shopping. Yeah, 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 we are, we are. We're just going for a walk or a ride. Not very far, apparently. Okay, I will grant you it does look a little more intimidating. Which does... Actually, there's lots of these little ruin things all over the place. I guess I guess there's nowhere f in Skyrim that's far away from some ominous-looking location. But this is... Okay, well, this definitely... Today smells lovely. I hope it does not rot as the hours pass. Well, we're about to head in there, so what do you think? Yeah. Definitely a place that wants you to know it's here. Okay, we don't know what to expect. Apart from apparently a spectacular view. Is that a troll? Inigo? Is that a tr is that a troll? Does that look like a troll? They have got troll lookouts? Is this the way up? Oh, you know what? Okay, night eye, five hours. And, um... Right, we have one thing without poison, one thing... Well, two things with, okay. Now, trolls, they're... In they go. Okay, stay close. Trolls, weak to fire, yes? So the sword, okay, I seem to be lacking a path. Is this... Okay, I see stairs. That almost looks... No. I can hear the troll. Now, usually... Don't trolls hang around in small groups? We normally see two together. It's deep snow here, isn't it? I'm wondering whether we should have come here at night or sleep-deprived. That 
does not look like a random piece of ice or snow. That is giving me the distinct impression of ghostliness. Okay. Yeah. Ominous. Okay, I'm going to do I will be here a quick when you return. Sweet. I've heard a troll over there. Now, trolls will actually ignore you if you stay away from them. So I'm thinking, let's stay away from them. Uh, just in case we do get caught off guard, actually, as, oh, as I've already said, fire. Why do I suspect I'm going to have to have some sort of encounter with that? I almost feel like that person, ghost, is waiting for me. Am I hearing... Well, there's a troll over there, but did I just... Inigo's not in trouble, is he? I usually would hear him fighting if... If he was. Why do I feel like there's a troll chasing me? Uh... I'm not... I'm not... Okay. Right. Yeah, so there's a troll there. Is he chasing me? No, he's not. Okay. In a go! We may have a troll situation. I, I don't know for sure. We may also have a I can't find the stairs situation, but never mind. I've solved that one. Ah. Yeah, I have a feeling that trot. Is he... Okay, is he... Usually, if we stay a little away from them, they'll, they'll ignore us, but... Apparently, not this time. Oh, God. Oh. Yes! froze their thoughts. <laughs> they were no challenge. Well, fiery sword with paralysis on it. It's it's a, it's a good, it's a good mix. Um, winter troll pelt. Mm. Trolls. I've got a few of those. I think at the museum. Pretty sure I do. Why did that troll have arrows? Okay. No, you know what? Come with me. I think we should just clear the trolls. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hello. Oh, I did not check for traps. <sighs> Definitely getting a little too eager beaver here. What? Why do I get the feeling you're saying something? I will miss you. What did you just whistle? What did you just whistle? Lead the way. No, you whistled something. I, I get the feeling I should be... Is this where the bog of eternal <laughs> stench is, or am I thinking of somewhere else? Dude, does this look like a bog to you? Does this look remotely... Okay. Just let's calm down and not forget that there are trolls around. I know trolls are not the toughest enemies we could possibly ever face. 
but um, still. Oh, I was going to say, I'm going to sneak up on him. Oh, no. I was thinking of sneaking up on him, and then you just decided to announce our presence. Well, fine. Kill him. Hit him. See? Fire and paralysis. Also poison. Okay. All right. You know what? I think I'm, I'm unlikely to be finding anything other than trolls here because most other creatures and sensible people don't move in where trolls are in residence so let's just run around and make sure the troll menace is well terminated and just before we head up to there and chat with the glowing person alright you know what now that I say that, I do suddenly realise this does mean there are possibly... Okay. This looks... interesting. Wooden mask. Okay. Orcish dagger. Take a quill. Missive from a hired thug. It seemed like an easy enough job. Groz and me done plenty like it before. Some chinless Breton wants bodyguards for a trip into the mountains. Fine. Easy clink for us. He goes on about this twice forsaken mask of his the whole way, of course. Got a pretty good laugh when Groz snatched it and put it on her face. He threatened to fire us for that one. Not smart out here on your own. He realised that right fast and shut up about not paying. Ah. Okay. Well, somebody got fairly viciously stabbed over this. The wooden mask hums with an unfamiliar energy. I'm getting this strange urge to try it on. And I don't think that's a great idea. It's sort of like a curiosity. What will happen if I put this mask on? I should probably clean it first. Yes, I probably should. Okay, it would seem there are a number of, well, at least one of the mystery here. It may be worth really checking this place out completely and thoroughly. Oh, hello. Huh. Oh, Shalador's maze. Okay, I don't know how I know that's Shalador's maze now that I... Now, you know what? How is it I... How is it I can just look at doors and somehow I know where I am? That's a talent, that is. That's a gift. Yes, it is. It's a gift. I always know where I am. I don't always know where I'm going. But, uh, hey. Ooh. Okay, I'm getting... Better and better at archaeology. And I don't think we need any of that. Okay, so we have something down here of interest. Um, and we have a troll. That is where I think I'm going, but... Oh. We haven't checked over there. We will, we will check over there in a, in a... There is precisely no chance we're going to sneak up on that troll, is there? No. Uh, I have a feeling the troll has already seen us. 
In, in it go, in it go, in, in it go, in it go. Shoot it. Shoot the smelly troll. Get his attention. You're not shooting. Thank you. Okay. You could shoot more. Thank you. Okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I have a feeling the poison that's on here will pretty much kill all of these things in a single swipe. I just would rather have some backup. In case. Alright. What do we have? We have another tr troll? Ooh. Lost Valkig! All right. There seems to be a number of ruins around here. And I'm I'm having I'm having funny thing with my eyes again. Okay, I'm I'm hearing troll. I'm going to guess. Oh no. I was gonna say I'm gonna guess stealth is pointless, and it is now. Alright, in we go. Shoot it! Fancy your chances, eh? Nice. Oh, I'm it. Okay. Right. Right. Yeah, th th that's what I mean by just in case. Just in case I miss. Right. That leads back onto that ledge. And this just le oh okay. Um right. This place is the sort of place that will drive a curious person quite mad. Luckily, I'm not a curious person. I've I've given it up. Yes, I have. The last time I got curious, I ended up in college and looking at a giant magical ball that would turn out to be more trouble than it's worth. So I'm off curiosity. Well, mostly. I am curious as to what's up there, so we're going to go and find out. But once we've done that, curiosity sated for the day. I've had my daily curiosity allotment. Are you coming? Wow, this place is bloody massive, really. Oh. Okay, has Inigo got lost? Don't walk backwards into the unknown. Has he got lost? Oh, please tell me he didn't wander into one of those places. He does that sometimes. <sighs> uh, this feels like... And, well, I was actually about to say a back entrance, but now I'm looking at it, it sort of feels more like the front entrance, and we came in the back entrance. But that looks like the front. It's overlooking. Okay, there you are. All right. I think we've got the lay of the land, as well as a wooden mask, and various points of interest. Hmm. Yeah. Shalidor. That was the... The, the, um... The book we were finding for Urag was one of Shalidor's writings. Did he ask us to get more of those for him? No, he, he told us to check back with him at a later date, didn't he? Oh, we probably... 
and it's close to a place where I ended up going. There's a little side of me... Yeah, you, you know what's coming, don't you? Thinks we should head back to the college to talk to Urag and uh, see if he has any information. That's the side of me that really wants to get all of the information before I do anything. However, that would mean going back to the college, which really sounds like a bad idea. So... Um... Yeah. Focus. This person is definitely waiting for something or some... Oh, well, it better not be waiting for Inigo, or it could be waiting a bloody while as he decides whether or not he wants to come up the stairs. You know what? I think stealth is pretty pointless. He's either going to attack us, or he's going to chat with us, or possibly both. Come on. We're finally here. Let's not waste any more time. Are we truly sure this is a good idea? We'll be back at the college before anyone even knows we're gone. You would care about that, since you're the Archmage's favorite. Don't forget, this whole idea was Atmas to begin with. Let's just get inside, see what's in there. Okay. Yeah, I, I never thought of the third possibility, which apparently is a rerun of some... So Savos was here, hence the reason he's got the talk of Labyrinthian. He was here. And that... is a ceremonial door and I have a feeling the torque I found is some kind of door knocker. We're going to put it in and we're going to knock and it's going to open in an ominous fashion because doors like that can't open in any other way. Although now I'd be kind of amused if we knocked on it and it just went Nice and quiet. I don't mind the snow. It's beautiful. You're interrupting my musings. You just, just, just... Y you are. Okay. I tell you what, the door may not open in an ominous manner, but I'm getting an ominous feeling. Why are there squiggles all over the door? And the floor. I mean, they look a little... Well... Well, a little strange, to be honest. Like... Well, like a child drew them. They're just, they're just all over the place. I mean, it's like somebody created a massive, impressive door. A door to strike fear into anyone who views it. And then some kid wandered along and just squiggled all over it. Although I suppose they would have had to have squiggled with a chisel. And probably required a ladder, which makes it a very industrious child. But, you know, I mean, there are squiggles out here. I think there's been squiggles on a lot of these ruins, maybe. I just haven't really been paying attention to them so much, maybe. But this one is really in your face. It really is. It's, it's a snow drift that's stopping me. You know, that could just be ancients doing their art thing on stone. I mean, it's actually quite difficult to chisel curves like that, I guess. Unless you're Dwemer. But this, this, this really does look... Well, do they have bring a child to work days in ancient Nordic cultures? I thought those were traps for a second. 
Okay, yes, I'm putting off the inevitable. Here goes. I knew it. I knew I was going to knock. I don't know why I'm sneaking. It's really bright. Okay. And it's really full of skeletons who apparently are all trying to get out of the door. That's a worrying sign. It's not a huge surprise. But it is a tiny bit worrying. Were they running away from some creature, some demon from hell? Or were they running away from some horrible magical explosion? You don't think what's happening at the college is happening here. Is Was there... Could the ball have been here? No, we sort of know it's always been at Sarthal. Could there be another ball? Did... Oh, God. I was about to say, did Magnus have two... Eyes. Did he have two eyes? Did he have... Oh, God, two eyes and a... You know what? I'm just... I can't believe we're doing this. Can you imagine the looks on their faces when we come back? You keep talking like you're sure we'll find something useful in here. Given the history of this place, it's more than likely there's still some amount of power here. Enchanted weapons, tomes of ancient knowledge, Shalador's secrets themselves. Who knows what we could find? Shalador's what secrets. If, what if there are things guarding this place? Against six college-trained mages? I think we'll be fine. I think you're not going to be... Fine. No, I don't. In fact, I have a horrible feeling. I don't recognize any of the names except Savos. This is obviously students from the college from long, long ago. Doing what students at the college do a lot, apparently, which is get themselves horribly killed. It definitely does not seem to be a profession with a long life expectancy, does it? I mean, he sort of always knew that, but I assumed, I assumed it was because they were trying to open portals to horrible nether regions, not that they were just poking around, hello, poking around water breathing. For a second, I thought it said water walking. I was going to say that, that really would be very useful. Yeah, um, poking around in Dungeons trying to find stuff. I mean, I know that's what we do, but we're professionals. And before we go on, let's do what professionals do and just make sure we haven't m missed anything. Okay, I think that is everything. So let's forge on ahead and find out. What happened to Savos's friends? It is very dark. You know, if you think about it, it would have been kind of useful for Savos to write a journal. I mean, he had the forethought, apparently, to hand a talk to Mirabel, knowing it would probably be useful. But didn't have the forethought to jot down a few notes on a piece of paper. Oh, by the way, Leonard, here is what you're going to face. Here is what I would avoid doing if you don't want to end up like my friends. But I guess he's a wizard, and wizards like their mysteries, don't they? Okay. It 
really is very, very, very dark here. You know, I'm... Stop pushing me. I'm heading deep into a mysterious ruin, probably filled with ancient artifacts of power. And I'm looting mushrooms I do not need. I am comfort looting. Okay. I see a lever, I see a gate. And of course I see more mushrooms because that's where they grow. In the dark. I'm hearing the sounds of skeletons. Or a skeleton. Oh. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. It's, it's dark hit. Okay. Those are spellcasters. Inigo, I'm afraid we've got a bit of a welcoming committee. Maybe... Come here. It is dark in there, so... Maybe they haven't seen us. Come here, although it really does look like they're waiting for us. Come back safe. I'm going to try and snip... Snip? Snip. Yes, I'm going to try and snip them. I'm going to nip in there. And, um... See if I can... Okay, let's just have a quick look. It is dark here. I may need to go invisible. All right, let's just see how they react to the gate going up. They... Oh. Ah, it would seem once we go in there, we're going to be committed to that course of action, Indigo, which is unfortunate because I have a horrible feeling that door opens just long enough for me to get in and leave you firmly parked outside. I could maybe send you in. Could maybe send you in and then try and get behind them. Would that work? Okay, let's see. Yes. Can I send you okay, into the dark part? Out. Right there. Okay. No. Alright. Uh okay, if I open it and then and I will do my best. Go there. Go. Oh, God, that's not going to work. That's not going to work. Okay, just... Come here. Come here. I think we're going to have to use the... Did they see you? I think we're going to have to use... I will be here when you return. ...the teleport. I think we're going to have to use the teleport. I'm going to sneak in and try and get to one side. Then I'm going to teleport you right in front of them. And then I'm going to sneak behind them and start stabbing them. Okay? Plan. It's a plan. Okay. And I need to be able to focus on the dark. All right. So, I am going... Open the... Open the door. Open. Here they go. Open. Crap. Oh. Crap, 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 crap. That's a dead dragon. That is a dead dragon. That is a dead dragon. That is... That is a dead dragon. Crap. 
Okay. Um, I have a feeling I am not going to be able to stab that in the back or poison it. I mean, where'd you stab a skeletal dragon? I can't even believe I'm asking that question. All right, okay, okay, okay. You're invisible, you're invisible, you're invisible, you're invisible. We've got... Don't loot, you will break invisibility. Do not break. Okay. Okay. Think, 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 think. Do I need to kill this. Is the Staff of Magnus in this room? Just look around me. Run, 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 run. Oh, no, I see, I see. I see another entrance. I see another entrance. I see another entrance. Okay. I don't want to waste the invisibility. Oh. How dark is it? Could I sneak around? Yeah, probably. I can't believe there's a bloody undead dra dragon. And you're worried about loot. You're worried about coins. You're worried about shiny things. Focus. Focus. Focus, 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 focus. Okay. Right. Staying in the dark, staying in the dark, staying in the dark. All right. I may be in luck. Skeletons, skeletons, do not go and inspect the dragon's dinner remains. Okay. So. Oh God, I feel exposed, I feel exposed, I feel very, very. All right. A plinth of some sort. All right. Okay, so I can sum... We... we have to go back. We can't leave Gerdwin. We barely made it out alive. What was that thing? You want to go back in? It's too late. There isn't enough of him left to go back in after. Gods, what have we done? Something stupid. go back. Might as well go forward. We can still do this. Uh, Zavos is right. We can make it if we just stay alert. Oh, not a chance. Not a chance. Wait, 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 wait. Was that... Was that... I recognized that voice. I wasn't really paying attention. Was that... Was that Mirabelle? Okay, so they came in to contact with... Old Skinny there. And, uh, did not fare well. Unsurprisingly. You see, ladies and gentlemen, this is... the true power of invisibility. Okay. So... Read the etched tab. Tell you what, before I start reading etched tablets, I'm going to summon Inigo. This may be the most useful spell I know now. Inigo, Inigo, Inigo. Thank you for the offer. No, 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 come, follow me, follow me. Oh, God, I forgot that. When I summon you, if I've told you to wait somewhere, you tend to want to try and go back to where I told you to wait. That could have gone very, very badly had you decided to run. Okay. Read the etched tablet. Hail all, brave city Bromjunar. Forever these walls shall stand. May enemies see her majesty. May all quake to behold her. Oh. 
Hail all brave city Bromjuna. Is that what this place was called? I mean, if you think about it, Labyrinthia is just an odd name for a place. Did, did this used to be a city? Okay, you know what? I'm I'm still getting this bizarre feeling. I can I can I can remember the last thing you said. So, uh... Exercising restraint. Okay, that's, 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 that's better. Okay. We're going... in. Okay, we've... got another door with squiggles on it. Although I have to say the squiggles look a little more grown up this time. Are those eagle heads or something? Just, are they dragon heads pointing down? Okay. I... Oh. Alright. A collapsed tunnel where this... I'm seeing what looks like an ice spell. You know. Like, wait, when you shoot something with a nice spell, and it just sort of... ...leaves a... What is working for you now? What? Did, did, did he say, what is your... I'm sorry, could you repeat the question? 